Sarukan aw. Sari bukan saya. Kuak kuak bukan saya. Sasa. Selain dia cakap kuak kuak. Kuak kuak dijika. Kuak kuak. Kuak kuak. Kuak kuak. Kuak kuak. Kuak kuak. Kuak kuak. Whether you're watching or playing football is a sure way to get your adrenaline kicking. Football is the one passion that unites people of different age, gender, social and cultural background and may prove effective in the world's fight for health, against hunger and eradication of poverty, especially among the youthful populations. Team 2011 and I Pata Toyan as a camp, as a coach, you know, and Bob Rapa Ivi, and Rapa Kichuna, and Wenjo, or Miss Yangla, so Napatako Inje, you know, you are Napatani, Kamani, you know, your Kiasi. You know, Kanik is a ball for long, Timetilit and Moreno, Na Katim, to learn more from a project Yashamba, looking at Sadia, Naishamba, in at Sadia car. Juku inje kwa bibanda mboga ni domingi. So sometimes tunapata maparo wa nadu. So tunakuja kwa tuna mboga, tunapeleka home. So, the most challenge that we do face in our this small garden is that one we don't have enough information on how to do the agriculture in small scale. Also we do have a challenge on, uh, on market as well as a space, we have a small space whereby we would like maybe to have a large scale farming on vegetables. Biovision Pharma Communications Program supported by Biovision Foundation has been reaching out to the urban youth through Madare Youth Sports Association, MISA, on how best to expand more into nutrition and food security. When you have information, they are supposed to guide you on how best to apply your resources, to use your resources. The outreach project has been educating players of the Moreno team, a slum football team under the MISA umbrella, on how best they can use the environment to improve their livelihoods. The children then take their knowledge home and share it with their families and also spread among their peers. One of the technologies that Njeri Kinuthia, Biovision Pharma Communication Program Outreach Officer, has been teaching the slum children is setting up kitchen gardens. The initiative started with an indoor session where the outreach officer had discussion with the team on different urban farm activities that can be implemented in the slum area. The topics ranged from poultry, rabbit keeping and kitchen gardens. The group chose to start with kitchen gardens the outreach officer then showed the team a farm training video on how to set up a kitchen garden. Later on, Biovision Africa Trust donated kitchen garden sacks, farm manure, soil, kale and spinach seedlings to the team. With the help of Njeriki Nudia, the team was able to plant their first kitchen garden within the grounds of Mysa Resource Center as a demonstration plot. Okay. 
It is hoped that this technology will be propagated across the different slums in the country as it is not costly and does not need a lot of space, yet the yields can be enough to feed a family, hence enhancing food security in the slum area. BioVision Africa Trust is exploring ways of working with the Moreno team to use the 11 popular players as youth ambassadors in farming and hopes to use this platform to ignite the youth's passion for farming, thus eradicating poverty.